How to turn AirDrop on and off on the iPhone 14. Welcome to one how to smartphones tutorial videos. In this video, I'll be showing you guys two different ways on how to turn your AirDrop on and off. Um, and I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys how that works. So let's just say you're out with a group of friends and somebody takes a picture and everybody wants that picture. Hey, send that to me, send that to me. Um, you are able to share it as like a multi, you know, as a quick text, if you wanna call it that, by doing an AirDrop, just dropping it to all the Apple users, all the iPhone users, you're able to pretty much uh, send it to them instantly. Um, you'll send it over and it'll notify them, letting them know, hey, do you wanna accept or de decline this uh, photo that's being sent? And it gives them that option to receive it that way, a lot faster than just sending a regular text. So the way to turn it on, we're gonna be starting off by going into settings. Uh, once you are in settings, go ahead and scroll down to general. Uh, once you are in general, right up here, you will see AirDrop. Go ahead and select that. So here we have uh, three different options, receiving off, meaning AirDrop is off, um, contacts only. So only the people in your contacts will be able to receive uh, the AirDrop or the notification to receive that AirDrop. And then uh, you can have it uh, set to everyone. So with contacts only, you have to be signed into your iTunes. So right here it says you must uh, sign into iCloud to be discoverable by contacts only. Uh, mine, I am not signed in, so that's why it's giving me this notification. Chances are you are probably signed in if you downloaded an app on your phone. You're probably signed in. So um, for me, I just use this phone as a tutorial, so nothing is signed in. None of my personal information is on it. Um, let's say you um, you can also set it to everyone. Uh, the thing about everyone, say you're at a sporting event or some kind of event, and uh, somebody decides for the fun of it, hey, I took this really cool picture. Let me airdrop it to everybody that's available. And uh, you can choose to accept or decline it, but you are open to, the, I guess, that invitation of, hey, do you want this picture or this image? So kind of uh, play at your own risk type of thing. Um, context only is usually where I, um, where I stick with, but that is how to um, set that. So, and here it says, AirDrop lets you share instantly with people nearby. You can be discoverable in AirDrop to receive from everybody or only people in your context. So pretty much what I just went over but um, you're able to set that right now. Even though the check mark is set to contacts only, it will not be set to that. It's probably gonna be set to everyone just because I am not signed in and it's gonna give me a one of the other options. So right now it's probably not set to there. So that is the first way. The second method is just by swiping from the top down, you will see this notification area. Um, we got the airplane mode, hotspot, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth. If you just press and hold on that square, the little, uh, you know, the two by two square, it'll open up this two by three square and right over here, we will see airdrop to everyone. So you can just, this will be a shortcut. You swipe down, press and hold. It's kind of like a long hold on that area. This pops up and you can go ahead, select airdrop right here. And right here it says receiving off. Uh, and then it's got contacts only and everyone. Same same met, um, menu as we saw previously, but it just you know gives us in a different view. Once again, I hit for contacts only. I need to be signed into my iCloud. All right, cool. So right now it's set to uh, receiving off. So there you guys have it. That is my quick little tutorial on uh, AirDrop, how it works and how to turn it on and off. Uh, I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up, share it with anybody who would benefit from seeing or hearing this information. And if you'd like to see more helpful tips and tricks, be sure to check out that playlist in the description below. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.